this is gonna be my first movie review, so okay. All right, this since this is gonna be my first review, I wanted to review a movie I really did not want to see. That movie is High School Musical 3. Now, I must admit, I hate the first one. I didn't even bother to see the second one, but. People really wanted me to see this movie just because, like, you don't, like, I never know. Uh, I might end up liking it, like I did with Hairspray. I thought it was going to be stupid, and I loved it when I saw it. Yes, yeah, that's another thing. A lot of people assume I hate musicals just because I don't like High School Musical. But in fact, I love musicals. Like, like, Moulin Rouge is my, this is my number three movie on my top ten list. Across the universe. Well, I didn't love it, but I liked it. I thought it was decent. And the producers. Well, same thing. I didn't love it, but I liked it enough to buy it. And Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. A classic. I love it. I have... I lost the tape, but I have to find it because I really want to watch it. <laughs> Alright. So, I went to go see this movie with a friend because I didn't want to be alone like a guy, I can go see Saw 5 or Max Payne or something. Uh, it'd be kind of embarrassing a guy going alone to see High School Musical 3. Yeah, so... Uh, I wanted to go see it. Bought some popcorn. Then, movie began. Uh, man, I don't know where to start. Okay, I'll start by saying this. I did not hate it. I did not hate it. Uh, I didn't like it either. Well, I didn't love it. I thought it was just okay. It was okay. It wasn't bad. So, yeah. I didn't hate it. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. Uh, it was okay. Uh, for high school musical fans, definitely, you have to go see it in the theater. But for average movie people like me, just catch it on DVD. It's nothing. It's nothing big to see in the theater. So... Yeah, that's my review. I'm not angry. Ugh. Yeah, I didn't... I came in, I came in like, expecting nothing. Like, I didn't expect to hate it. I didn't, I didn't expect to hate it. I didn't expect to like it. I just came in open-minded. And I thought it was okay. Yeah, and the girls in the theater were crazy. Seriously. This is... The first shot is Zac Efron going like this. <laughs> and, the, and the girls went... <laughs> Seriously, there was even a movie preview of Zac Efron's new movie, and all the girl when Zac Efron popped up, and all the girls were, ah! come on, seriously. Oh well. All right, let me get into some complaints because, like I said, it's just okay. Uh, like around two songs were pointless. Like, well, basically the movie has no plot, so I can't really say they were pointless because the whole movie's pointless, and. Oh yeah, at the end, there's a shot with the High School Musical logo popping up, and then they do their freeze frame jump, like this in the cover of the first two movies. And I thought it was going to be over, but yeah, that would have been like a good ending for all the High School Musical fans to see, uh, to see the logo, them jumping in the air, in the theater, that would be a good ending for all the fans. But no, the movie just kept on going. Seriously. No. So... Yeah, if you're if you're a fan, definitely check it in the theater. But if you're just like me and just watch movies all the time, just check it out on DVD if you really want to see it. 